Welcome back to Let's Play Control. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time, we cleansed and bound with the unexpected, uh, merry-go-round horse, uh, object of power, and it gave us the ability to do this. Now that's fast. <laughs> Let's find out about it before we go have a chat with Ati. Merry-go-round horse. Oh, no, wait, uh... Okay, obtained in, uh, June 1998. Then, uh, containment location. Uh -huh. Merry-go-round horse. Object of power 16-KE. Object should be kept in a confined space when unbound. A fiberglass horse once used as a seat for a merry-go-round ride. The pole is still connected to the object. The object is capable of moving short distances at high speeds. This can be quite dangerous when people are in its path. The object is currently bound by Jesse Faden. I'm just saying. Sometimes you can fill in the blanks. The object was discovered at the site of an abandoned amusement park. Local Redacted reported that the rides would move on their own and that they would be chased out. When these rumors reached the Bureau, see America Overnight, episode 235, agents were dispatched to the scene. Three local Redacted were found dead at the scene. Or dispatched to investigate, I see. I was reading the next line and that line at the same time. My bad. The object attacked agent redacted by redacted. Agents invoked formula C.5 to redacted the object long enough to redacted. That sounds genuinely hostile. I'm surprised all it does is give me a dodge. Oh! I did that! Cool! But I'm not going to go back just yet, because we really need to find Ati, and if I leave, uh, ventilation again, those dudes will re-re- will re-respawn. Jesse learns of another object of power, a merry-go-round horse below the break room. She cleanses the merry-go-round horse and gains the evade ability, the power to rapidly dash short distances. Oops. Check a there. That worked out better than I kind of expected it would. Hey, it's O. Oh. Jesus Christ, I thought that was a window when I first glanced over there. Is the joke going to be I'm going to open the door and he's going to be standing in exactly that position? Ooh. I know what that means. Shatter projectile choke. Projectile spread minus 10%. So it'll concentrate the shotgun effect. You know what? Let's not shoot in here. Ati might get mad at us. And if he really is a part of the house, I don't want that to happen. Called it! Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yippee, Sadana. It happened in the last drop. What? I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted, otherwise I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. It's just around the corner. At the moment. But first, we need to get you working. Very small couple of hours job. Something tells me it's going to be more than that. Ah, 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 you think there's a dog buried in this? I can tell you what? are not the yesterday's Krause's son. That's why you make a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. I know that one. A bad one. 
they've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the power generators of a power plant, Berkele. And the pensioner inside. Um. He's starting to feel the pant around his head tighten. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappear like a fart in Sahara. Trying my best to keep up with this. Yeah, ditto. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow. Oh, yeah. And don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the trip before I go to my vacation. The works on the task board here, you can do later, when you have time. Vacation? Right. Yes, no one's gonna cancel my holiday or seeds gonna rattle. But don't worry at all, you'll take care of it and soon this crisis gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. Thank you, Ati. I'm going to guess some of that was directly, like literally translated Finnish idioms, because a lot of that didn't make any sense. And that's just kind of the vibe I got from saying things like, you don't want to use your head as your third leg. Oh. Shit, I didn't mean to do yep. that. Burn the dress. Throw it in the fire. Burn it all. Throw what in the fire? Burn I was looking at the subtitles. Burn it into a reindeer. Not into a moose. Okay, that can't be an idiom. That can't mean anything. Oh, uh, Perkala is a, uh, I don't know what it means. I do know it is an all-purpose Finnish swear word. Uh, thanks, Ati. I can think I can, uh, handle preventing us all from blowing up. Oh, it's time for a coffee break, so... All right, let's just get out of here. Since I keep predicting things, um... Uh... Oh, yes, Gundy's lackey, and I'm assuming... That uh, they're okay, saying so this. What so. happens again if that thing blows up? Power explosion. Too much. Director's duty. Keep the lights on. That's not creepy at all. Yeah, Gundy's lackey would like to predict that the house is the sinister evil behind it all. And again, I'm assuming that's without, uh, you know, actual prior knowledge, because that would be a dick move. I was half expecting him to be gone. Oh, hey. Ooh. I should probably look at that. that and what a mess burn the trash burn the trash around the furnace Jesse helps Ati by burning the trash piled up around the furnace in the maintenance sector oh joy it's a category no 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 we're not looking at that I just didn't want it to be blinking anymore Northmore it's not about the power uh, system all right all right let's hear about the guy before the guy before me North Moore was director before me. I never wanted his job. I never wanted power. I purposefully avoided it. Didn't trust it. Didn't want to rely on it. North Moore was all about power. A man like an explosion, hungry for authority, for order, for more. Until it was too much. I had to find a solution in the end. 
contain the situation. Northmore never liked me, but he went along with it, to his credit. He didn't really have a choice. I suppose at the end of the day, a director's most basic duty is to keep the lights on. I see what you did there. Here's to you, Northmore. There were no prime candidates waiting in the wings, but I was there. Had been the whole time, keeping my head down, working my ass off. I had nothing to lose. I picked up the gun almost on a dare. Wow. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, got myself all turned around. They don't appreciate music. I believe you. That's the reason they can go as far as Pepe Claus. Man, he really is a Looney Tune. Uh, right. So I'll just say that uh, Ronan Drake says hi again, and uh, off I go. Wait. Powder. Oh, oh, that one did load in a more sharp uh, texture. More sharp. They don't appreciate oh. music. That's the reason. As Pepper grows. Where the fuck am I meant to be going? Uh, okay, that seems like it will bring me in the right way. So where's that go? Go well, back out to ventilation, I see. Yeah, this room. Oh, you know, I might as well. I might have to fight those guys again. I'm just gonna run through and kill them on my way back. How's that sound? Fast travel! What? Why is that one? Oh, that's the one I'm at, derp. I need their notes on this thing today. No, that's about it. Good, good, good. Shout out to you, specific viewer. I hope you're having a good day. You've got something on your lip from lunchtime. Who the hell does she think she is? I'm standing right fucking here. Taking uh, was that like uh I, th I thought it was like taking over the something something office. Like is that about me being the director? Cause uh Emily's in the boardroom, not an office. All I need to do is be poked at the solution. The solution is even possible. Am I distracting? Uh, right, uh let me see. Board countermeasures. Oh, I see. Collect reward, a personal mod. Shatter hatchet burst will push them back. How far? Energy boost! Doesn't tell me how strong it is. I don't have uh, even access to those for the most part. Oh, yeah, that's going to be a while. Mods right now. Abilities! Hello. Oh, I see. Yes, yes. Good. Well, I guess. And. Okay. Excellent! Just checking. I didn't think I had any new ones, but off I go. Rock me like a loading screen. I love the way this game continues to present me with non sequitur after non sequitur. Oh, 
fuck. I saw that guy, or the guy right next to me come from. Well, you see, when the hiss love a human very much. Wrong button. Ah! Very bad choice of tactics. I'm gonna borrow that real quick and kill you with it. And then I'm gonna kill you with it. Mmm, delicious. Yoink! I could use more dots. Maybe I should put that other one back on, the one that makes me heal faster. No, I've only got level two. Well, that was not intentional. Or no, wait, where was that other door I found? You know what? I know the way there from here, so I'll just do it. Uh, that was not the way. I uh, immediately took a wrong turn. Hey, the poster is gone. That's weird. Hey, Ati. Yes. Bye, Ati. This looks like the right place. Yeah, this isn't ominous at all. I don't like that, although the house could have done it, so hey, whatever. I can't crouch, that's weird. I also don't have a gun anymore. There it is. Erish, escaped OOP. Attention, maintenance staff. An object of power escaped the Panopticon a couple weeks ago, and they want everyone to keep an eye out for it. So if anyone sees a merry-go-round horse zipping around the sector, alert me immediately. Do not try to contain it on your own, and definitely don't bind it to yourself. Your security chief, Simon Erish. Huh. Oops. Mind you, I've seen it have so much power that the uh, artifacts react differently to me than everyone else. I don't know why that was my first response to that. Or why they have so many goddamn... These aren't even forklifts. What are these? Well, I guess they're really big fans of bumper cars, then. What chaos I could create in here. Hot damn. Can't help but notice. Oh, he's wearing one of those things. I was wondering why that guy wasn't killing me. Yet. It's dangerous out here, lady. Go oh, see Chief Arishi. He's just inside. He'll help you. That's sir to you. Ma'am, I guess. I don't know. I'm not picky. Oh, in the security booth. And this one's labeled security. Hello, you Ma must be that guy. Hey. Chief Arish, FBC security. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? Shouldn't you have a gun or something? They all have HRAs. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah, Chief Arish, FBC security. I'm just... Oh, hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> Uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. And Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? 
No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> Crazy dude. That is Barry strange. Knew the hiss was coming. Listen, well, we already knew I that. I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this baby blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling him? Well, that's catchy. Well, listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. Well, at least he can't read Price my thoughts. Oh, I guess there's something over there. Why is that wall important? C through F. Is the clock back? Now? Oh, man. Adi is going to be so pissed. When the converters and coolant pumps are working again, we should be able to get this baby back down to a safe temperature. I hope. Well, the timer did just go, so I'm just going to call it there and uh, talk to this guy after that. Right. You got a lock down the lift. I think we'll finish it on this lore, whatever it is. That guy, security measures. Uh, oh, what was that flicker there? To Erish from Salvador, subject, keep a lookout. Hey, Simon, I got your message. Yeah, if someone in the sector is asking what Ati, just tell them you'll handle it and leave it at that. Under no circumstances should any personnel intervene with his day-to-day -day routine. I told you everything I know about him, so you could better deal with his odd habits, but yes, it's still very much a classified matter. Also, I saw your report with the quarry worker who wandered into the Foundation. Detaining him was the right move. We'll figure out what he saw before we decide on next steps. Cheers, Lynn. P.S. In case you hadn't noticed, something is up between Trench and Darling. I know this isn't your strong suit, but try your best to stay out of it. Hmm. The fuck is the Foundation? I wonder if that was a reference to the SCP Foundation. Or the Foundation of the Building, perhaps. Again, with this game, it is entirely possible we will never know, gentlemen. And, uh... I guess we'll just have to deal with that. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you next time on when we take care of that. Blows, we're all going with it. Oh, thanks, Frank. You're positive. Better step out here away from the voices. Later.